friends. I've got a little grocery haul today. Um, grabbed a few things from Walmart and a few things from Publix just to restock the pantry. And I've got some cooking and prep going on this weekend. So let's see what I got. All right, I'll start with Walmart. Um, I got some sour cream, some irregular sour cream. And actually I also got some light sour cream. I don't know why I put that over there, but um, some of this is for baking that's coming up and some of it is because I ran out of the light sour cream and we're having tacos on Tuesday. So that's what that's about. I'm making some loaded potato soup today. Um, and so some of this is for that, but so that's why I have two things of the bacon and then, um, some lunch meat, just some, um, of this black forest ham my husband likes and taco Tuesday. Um, they've been out of pretzel rods. I don't know why, if there's like a shortage of pretzel rods, but everywhere I've been has been out of pretzel rods since before Thanksgiving. So they had them today. And I grabbed them because I'm going to make some chocolate covered um, and some peppermint bark pretzel rods. So I needed them and some pretzel mini twists because I got an idea for those two. I'm just not sure when I'm going to do that. Told about the soup and we were out of oyster crackers. So grab some of those. They actually had the Great Value brand today. And so we're going to... Um, give those a try. I don't, I don't think there's much difference between those and then, um, the actual name brand. Um, I haven't tried this before. It's the white cheddar and I am a white cheddar lover. So I always get the regular baby bell, but I'm trying this today. So I'll, I'll let y'all know later how that is. And Again, with some recipes coming up, had to grab some sharp cheddar, and also we just like cheese. Not going to lie about that. And remember I told you about that extra sharp cheddar? Well, there you go. Got some more of that. Because I'm lazy and I don't want to cry, I, I buy chopped onions and keep them in the freezer. So there you have that. Another bag of cheese. That's garnish, actually, um, for the soup I'm making today. And this is part of that soup. I, I've got, I'm making some hash brown casserole later this week, but that's not what this is for. I use the shredded for that. This is actually, I'm going to try this in my loaded potato soup instead of cooking potatoes and all of that today to see how that turns out. So come back later and see, see how that ended up. Um, my favorite bacon, got to get some of that. And you know, I love this great value, um, thick sliced bacon and they had the mega packs today. So we're all about that. A couple of party pizzas and we are digging this motor city pizza. My sister actually turned me on to this, um, deep dish motor city pizza. And so we kind of, when we have a stay at home date night, we will, cook one of these and the freezer was getting low on pizza. So I grabbed one today and that's just a quick lunch for later this week. But that's what I grabbed at Walmart. And I think it was a little over 80 bucks for, um, for that little haul from Walmart. And then went next door to Publix and grabbed a few other things. I really like Publix's lunch meats better. Um, they've got the boar's head. And so I got some sandwich pepperonis some salami and some boar's head turkey there. Uh, I like their sliced cheese at Publix, so I grabbed mozzarella and provolone for those sandwiches I love to make for CJ's lunches. And then I grabbed a couple chicken breasts because um, that's what we're gonna have for supper tomorrow night. He was wanting some chicken on the grill, so that's what we're doing. It's just the two of us this week. Um, they had these Pillsbury brownies and they had their cake mixes also. BOGO, I've never tried the Pillsbury brownies, so they're family size. I'm giving them a try for buy one, get one. I thought, let's give that a shot and see. Pepperonis, I got something coming up and I'm actually gonna use these mini pepperonis as garnish on a Christmas tree. They're gonna be the Christmas ornaments, so you're gonna wanna come back and see that. Um, and then my very favorite of all time, 
the Tillamook snack portion, sharp white cheddar cheese is BOGO. This is all they had though. I would have stocked up like crazy, but they only had two bags of it and I grabbed it and I talked to the guy and they're going to have more tomorrow. So I'll be going back for some more of that tomorrow. Got to make a couple of pies this week. So we've got some, hold up. I was in the middle of filming and somebody just came and snagged some brownies. Um, <laughs> okay, I don't know what that was about. All right, graham cracker crusts. Um, for the pies I've got coming up, more cheese, some Laughing Cow Light. Um, these are gonna be, remember I told you about the pepperonis that are gonna be ornaments. This is gonna be the garland for something that I'm making and it's gonna be super fun. Uh, some baking coming up that I needed the heavy whipping cream and the cherries for. And this is what just got snagged. I bought two boxes of these snowflake brownies. I've never tried them before. I don't know if they're any good or not. I went to get Little Debbie Christmas trees for something I was going to make. And they were out of Christmas trees everywhere I went. But I saw these and I thought, well, these are cute. I could even actually add these to a charcuterie board later for a Christmas party. So I snagged them for that. But I got two boxes and... CJ just walked in here and grabbed a box and took off with it. So I don't know what that's about. Um, and they had my creamer. Y'all, if you haven't tried this creamer, this is the bomb.com. The caramel macchiato zero sugar creamer from Starbucks. It's always out of stock. Walmart doesn't carry it. I find it at Publix. I've seen it at Kroger when I've been uh, out of town and gone to a Kroger before. I have seen it there, so you might, if you have a Kroger near you or a Publix near you, you might be able to find it there, but I love it. It is the best. So anyway, there's um, my two little mini hauls, pantry restocks, um, holiday baking, and just feeding the two of us um, for this week. So I think this also was around 80 bucks. I didn't say that. I think so between the two, about $160, $170 um, for those two hauls. But all right. Well, um, thanks for stopping by. I'd love for you to like, comment, share. Please subscribe to my channel. Um, and until next time, have an extraordinary life and we'll see you tomorrow.